You're joining me in Dark Cloud. Look at me. Look at my little scrawny guy. Now we learned the truth about uh, Photo and Goro last time. So let's go talk to Goro. See if he's, uh, what he's going to do. I'm not actually sure if this is what we have to do, but I figured it's a good idea. Shut up, phone. My bag is full. What's up, bro? I uh, want to talk to you. Killer snake, that thing really exists? Did it really get my paw? Hmm, never mind, you wouldn't know anyway. Do I have anything I can prove it to him? Nope, I don't think so. I do want to use something in my... Ah, here we go. Use this. And this. We have another one of these. I guess we can get that, give that to Kidders. Yeah, there we go. Oh, and another gourd. Awesome. We can give that to Town then. Which, who I think is close to max on water. Um. I'll find out eventually what to do here. I seriously can't remember. I think, actually, let's go back to the dungeon. And see if there's any proof. Actually, can I ask around town? Do I have anybody else I can throw down? I have the mushroom people. Here we go. Let's talk to him. Up into the creepy guy's house. Or don't go in this door. It's day 12 dusk, in case you were wondering. Into the door we go. What's up, dude? Playing your little guitar? Oh, it's you. The house is back now and I can finally sing again. Thanks to you. Will you listen to something of mine? No, thank you. I see. Then you can just stay there. The title is Legendary Hunter. Photo, mighty photo. Will you find his prey? Yeah, I didn't really want to listen to this. How did you like it? It's an original piece. The Legendary Hunter. Isn't it? It's a tribute to Photo. Cool, isn't it? Cool. Thank you. This song shows Photo's charisma, or shall I say his power or prominence. I think it's expressed well in the song. Only Photo fans like myself could write it. Hey, you sound like a douchebag. It's been five years now since Photo left. He was awesome. Really amazing. He was the hero of our village. No one could beat Photo. He was invincible. Back then, the villagers were attacked by fearful monsters called White... Oh, by a fearful monster called the White Tiger. Many hunters lost their lives fighting the White Tiger. But Photo, he killed that very White Tiger in one blow. His power was tremendous. After that, Photo became a hero. The entire village respected Photo and worshipped him as a guardian god. Photo was my idol. I knew I couldn't be like him. I've always been skinny and weak. Work out, you dick. But Photo made even a person like myself believe I could be strong. Like magic, I felt I could do anything. But then five years ago, he disappeared. There were rumors that he was killed by a monster called Killer Snake. These guys are very original with their monster names, just saying. They said, though injured, he still fought the Killer Snake and died bravely. But I don't believe that. Photo is too strong, I'm sure he's still alive somewhere. No half-wit Killer Snake could stand a chance against our hero. I'm right, right? I don't know. If you saw Photo, you would understand right away. 
This sound guy sounds like he's got a thing for him. Just saying. Not judging or anything, but just saying. So I bet my performance made you want to try a musical instrument too. No, not really. Sorry, this is my treasure. I can't give it to you. Just a minute. Oh, flute! I made myself. It has good sound to it. Oh, excellent. This is what we need, actually. But it sounds like a mouse. Don't play it in strange places or you'll attract snakes. Hmm. Maybe we need to, uh, just throwing this out there, attract a snake. Let's go. Let's go, guys. I mean, serpent blade sounds like something used to kill a snake, right? Or it sounds like it was made out of a snake. That'd be weird. The Territory Nine. All right. So we're in Territory Nine. First of all, where the hell is my serpent blade? Equip that mother. Here we go. Now let's play this odd flute. It's like an ocarina, almost. Ah, oh, snake! The big snake. Alright. You ready? Snake fighting time. God, listen to this music. God, epicness. On snake. Yeah, look at me. I cut that bastard's head off. And then he disintegrated. Serpent Sword has completed its mission. Awesome. Now it's an evolvable sword. That's what I needed it to be. And sparkles on the ground. We got a bone pendant. Alright, and now that this is an evolvable sword, let's just pimp this out. We're gonna pimp this out to the max. Why? Because we can. We can throw that on there, which has the quencher. Let's throw more of these so it has more attack. Upgrade it again. Let's sense sphere this. Throw that on this. There it is, chopper. Now damage is max. Excellent, that's 70. Actually, can I build it up? No, I still need more magic. I need a bit more stuff. That's fine. So metal and ma or magic slain is what I need there. Ice is what I need for both of them and magic. Okay. So let's... Do I have anything that... That increases magic. Doesn't increase anything there. Increases that. Do we have anything that increases... That increases one of all of those. What does the pearl do? Ah, hey, there we go. Oh, it increases both of the things we need. Awesome. So let's upgrade that. Alright, now what does this do? It gives us ice, which we need, and magic slain, which we also need. We only have one of those, though. That sucks. That also gives us ice. Does that give us magic? Or we get all magic? Oh, we can actually... Oh. Uh, do I want to upgrade it yet? I don't know if I want to upgrade it yet. Let's uh, keep just chugging stuff into it. Oh, that increases magic too. Yeah, let's do that. 
Excellent. Now we have a Serpent Sword plus four. Who do Sapphires do again? Wind and Fly. Don't need either of those. Do we have Metal Breaking? Yeah, we do. Let's do this on there. And then... Uh, well, all of those are maxed. Let's do some more ice. Why not? sure which one I want so give me a second and I will check that out and you guys will know here in a few seconds okay everyone I am back and I believe we're gonna go with the evil size because evil sounds cool so let's you get to see the magical transformation of this sucker look at that god look how beautiful that looks Everything can be upgraded more. What do I need? I need a lot of those stats and rock. I still have one power-up powder, so... Let's do that. That gives me magic and wind, which we need wind. That gives us thunder. What, do we need everything other than holy? Yeah. Gives us ice. Do we have anything that gives us rock though? Doesn't look like it. That's unfortunate. So let's just throw those upgrades on there. So we have ice and thunder done, so it looks like we need 39 of those. So we need more wind. Which I don't. Yeah, this gives it wind. Awesome. So we have it wind, and then some fire. So then wind should be good, and then we'll just need to upgrade fire, and get some rock breakers. I don't know where we're going to get those, but look how BA that weapon looks. Yeah. And it also has quench on it, so that's nice. Then off camera, I will upgrade one of these so it'll have steel on it. Man, we are way too powerful for our level. Or where we are. Look at that puppy. It's not super fast, but it will do. Alright, so now let's head out. We'll go talk to Goro about his long-lost father, who is apparently dead by that snake that I easily slaughtered. So... I'm clearly better than he was. I wonder how Gore's gonna feel about that. Silly dwarfs. Dwarf man. Hey. What's up, dwarf man? Here's your bone pendant. Is this significant to you in any way? Wait, this is my paws. Where did you get it? What? Uh, excited. P -p pa. Do I like the stash he's supporting? Goro, how have you been? Dad, where the heck have you been? I thought you were dead. I'm sorry, Goro. Forgive me for having suddenly left you all alone. I am dead. Goro, I'm no longer of this world. See, he's dead. I'm a spirit now. No, you're lying. It's the truth. Before I died, I put a message into a pendant. The father you see is that message. Carefully, Goro. The evil force that attacked this village is now de devouring the entire world. With your allies, you must stop it. If you are really my son, then show me. Honor me and all hunters through your courage in battle. 
No, no way. What a dick. Everybody in the village left you to die. I ain't gonna help those cowards. You misunderstood them. I was not betrayed by fellow villagers. As you know, I was said to be the best hunter in the village. I killed even that brutal white tiger in one blow. Yeah, we've heard about that. But that doesn't look very healthy. He seems to be coughing up blood. But my body was being gradually weakened by an illness. And I realized I had very little time left for myself. I was a prideful hunter. My pride would not allow me to die of illness. I wanted to die in battle as a hunter should. Totally respectable. One day I went into the woods with a fearful killer snake dwelt, taking with me several villagers. I thought the powerful killer snake would be a perfect opponent to end my career as a hunter. But deep inside I wanted to die in this battle. That very hunt was my plan to end my life with pride. Thus I challenged the killer snake to a reckless fight. I, of course, fought my best. But it was obviously I it uh, was obvious I was not a match for the killer snake with my body weakened by illness. In the end the killer snake got me and started to squeeze me slowly. And I saw my fla fading flame of life start to flicker away. It was what I had wished for. I chose to die with bravery. The villagers that were with me left quietly. I still remember the sadness in their eyes. Yeah, that looks very sad. They probably all knew. Knowing it all, they stayed to see it through to the end. They still to this day speak of me as the strongest hunter there ever was. You call them cowards, Goro but they kept the truth hidden out of respect for me. But, but, but why? Why did you do that? Goro, one day you'll understand. I'm a hunter. I wanted to die a hunter, not an invalid. And you, you're also a hunter. Go fight, Goro. Join with the other warriors and fight evil. Be a greater man than me. Goro, I am always with you. Oh, it's so sad. Yeah, I hate you. Yeah, I hate you, Pa. I'm just like, what? What are you looking at? Me saving the world? Not likely, but I want to give it a shot anyway. Not for the villagers or for Dad, but for me. I'll fight for me. What the hell's with that background? I'll become Goro, mighty hunter of legend. Hooray! Call me whenever you're in trouble. I'll do better than you. I don't know, I killed that snake pretty easily. Your dad seemed to have trouble with that. He was sick. Alright guys. Back into the Matatati village. I think that's a good place to call it for today. We uber upgraded the serpent blade. Um, I mean like uberly upgraded. Like, Let's just admire it. The evil size. That thing gorgeous. And we'll hopefully build that up here soon. We're almost there. And then, after that becomes a beautiful, beautiful self. Um, I don't know where we're going to go next. I don't know what I was going with that kind of, or that statement, but it'll be beautiful. So I shall see you next time with the wise owl in the fore or in the background. And farewell.